Hey guys, the Super Review Show for another episode of Why You Should Watch. This is the show where I break down movies and TV shows that I recommend personally that you know that you may you may have heard of, you may not have seen, or you may have seen depending on when it came out. Um, but this is a special one because you know this month in June is we're in June of 2023. Um, as the title of this video suggests, we're talking about why you should watch Jurassic Park, the very first one. Um, now, if some of you are already saying, like, "All right, look, I've seen Jurassic Park." I've seen, you know, the the Jurassic World series now. They kind of did a giant finale with it with Jurassic World, like um, Dominion or whatever, uh, or Fallen Kingdom. I forget what the last one was called. Um, but if you go back to the very first one, it truly is a classic in cinema 100%. It's one of the best films, like, period, of all time. Because when you think of, de- like, adventure movies, you typically think of, like, Jurassic Park or... Indiana Jones or things like that, but those are the big in my mind when I when I see them when I, when I, when I say when I say to someone, hey, think of an adventure film. They're like, all right, uh, Jurassic Park, and typically as I first think of those two. That's me. Everyone's different. It's all good, but um, I think Jurassic Park, <laughs> Jurassic Park is one of those movies you just have to see it to believe it. I feel like a lot of people have seen it though, like who are, or like in my generation who are born like the late nineties and you know grew up to do, be YouTube sensations. Just saying. Um, not really. I'm not a YouTube presentation by any stretch. I'm just saying, but um, it's a great movie overall, and it really was one of Sp- one of Spielberg's finest. Absolutely, one hundred one hundred percent one of his finest. Um, such a great movie uh, on so many different levels. Because at the time, and you look, but if you want, if you put on the movie now, thirty years later now, and you look at, it, you're like, oh my god, the graphics still hold up. Like the graphics still hold up to this day. The effects really have held up since then, and it came out in the early '90s. It's hard, and te- from a technological standpoint, it really does hold up. From a narrative standpoint, it holds up. The only difference, though, is yes, they made a Jurassic Park two and three, and then Jurassic World and all them. But if you go back, because it is based on a book called Jurassic Park, if you go back and read the book Jurassic Park, um, I'm surprised we didn't bring this up when we talked about when we talked about. Uh, film adaptations that the author author hated. I don't, I don't know if uh, I, I don't know if the author of Jurassic Park hated the movie or not. I don't know that offhand, but I feel like he may have. Because when it comes down to it, most books, like authors of you know the book, and then it turns into a movie. They're like, ah, they messed up the movie, whatever. But at the, at the same time, both mediums take their own liberties. Like if you have a book like Jurassic Park, and you change some stuff with it. Uh, the, the movie, which they did, I'm telling you why in a second. Spoilers if you haven't, if you haven't seen the movie, but um, at the very end of the movie, the, they set it up to have a, a sequel, to be a franchise. At the very end of the book, they blow up the island and they kill the dinosaurs. Um, it's a, just the, the two different endings of the book and the movie compared to, you know what I mean? So, um, that's just a, a quick you know difference between the two. Um, but why should you watch... Jurassic Park. Why should you watch Jurassic Park? Well, here's the deal. Jurassic Park, to me, is a pillar of Hollywood cinema. It is truly one of the works of art that is Hollywood. Uh, and obviously directed by Steven Spielberg, produced by Frank Marshall and Kathleen Kennedy and all them. You know, that whole group of people that are um, very um, synonymous with Hollywood. Um, but yeah. This is a great movie. I highly recommend you. Just, I highly recommend you watch it, especially now that it's June of 2023 and the movie has turned 30 years old as of this month. Hard to believe that Jurassic Park has now turned 30 years old as of this month, June of 2023. Um, hard to believe, really. Anyways, I digress. This is a great movie to watch. It's a good summertime flick too. If you're sitting in your backyard but want to put the projector up, whatever. This is a great movie to go see. Um, you know, just put up in your, like in your rented on, I think it's on Peacock, I believe, um, or whatever streaming service you have, just watch it on there. It's no problem whatsoever. And it's, it's, it stood the test of time. It's a, just a fantastic movie overall. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching. Why you shouldn't watch like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications. We do a bunch of these all the time. Um, but yeah, but for all of your, why you should watch videos and many more, keep it locked on the super view show. The J man is off the rock. We'll see you guys later.